Welcome to Safari Science. My name is Reptile Rob, and learning's fun. So let's learn how snakes poop. Yeah. 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 I have my friend Chocolate Chip with me, and we're gonna learn a little bit how snakes go to the bathroom. Sounds exciting? Well, it is. A lot of times when I do shows for children at schools and events, I get asked this question by a giggling child. They're like, hee hee hee, and they have their hand up, and I know what the question's gonna be. The question's gonna be, how do snakes go poop? Now, the answer is much easier than you might think to answer that question. How do snakes go poop? They take a deep breath in, and then they push really hard, and then they go. But the question they really want to ask is, where do snakes go poop from? Excellent question. So if I ask for a guess, the first guess is usually from the tail. Completely logical. It's the back end, and that's where that stuff usually comes out. But take a look right here. See the tail? It's very, very small. So if he goes to the bathroom from that part, it's gonna take a long time. So no, they don't go from their tail. The second guess I usually get for how snakes go to the bathroom is from their mouth. Ew, that's just gross. They don't poop from their mouth. No, 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 no. So we still don't know how they go or where they go from. The place where snakes go to the bathroom from is called the vent. And in your house, there are many vents. They're called air vents. On a snake, the vent is located where the body stops and the tail starts. So I'm going to show you. Right here, this guy has a really short tail, about that long, and then the body stops right there, and that is the vent. It's called a vent and not a bum, because there's no cheeks. Yeah, and that's where snakes go to the bathroom from. Bring that up at dinner and try not to get in trouble. I'm Reptile Rob, here's Chocolate Chip. See you guys next time. Bye.